It's day two of pre-inauguration activities build up to the Sonwolu Hamzat swearing in for a second term in office. Are three activities in one event, a public lecture, book launch and a stage play dissecting the making of a beacon, Lagos and the consolidation of a democracy that works for all. Former Deputy Vice-Chancellor of the University of Ibadan, Adigwa Baje, lauded what he called an excellent succession strategy and plan instituted in Lagos, giving kudos to the kind of leadership and governance that Lagos exemplifies for Nigeria and indeed Africa. Professor Agbaje noted that sometimes chaos and crisis help trump up good deeds that will help unfreeze the democratic order, which may be great for good governance. The burden that Lagos carries for the whole of Nigeria, Lagos is the exemplar that shows that things can work in Nigeria and therefore that what we require may be the right combination of leadership and opportunity. Lagos is showing the way, and it is important for you to know that whatever is happening to Lagos has implications, not just for Lagos, but for pointing the path to the future of the rest of Nigeria. The 19-chaptered book with 301 pages is majorly a compilation of Mr. Governor's activities and management of the COVID-19 pandemic. No wonder the book is christened The Incident Commander. For the authors and reviewer of the book, it sums up Governor of Sonwolu as courageous and compassionate, charismatic leader who passed the test of faith when crisis came calling. It is during moments of turbulence that the exceptional skills of a good pilot will come into play. Governor Sonwolu proved to be a good pilot, a good crisis manager, who defied all the odds to give his followers true quality leadership and statesmanship. Governor Sonwolu thanked all those who made his first term a success, assuring the people that he will double up on the promises and not take their support for granted. With all of the support you have given us, especially during the last election, you have confirmed you know, that you, you are happy with what we're doing. And the only way we can pay you back is to do a lot more, is to double up on all of our promises, is to ensure that we do not disappoint, is to ensure that we can bring hope to the hopeless, we can give voice to the voiceless, and we can give belief to the vulnerable in our society, provide security of life for our citizens. A dance presentation by the cultural troupe and stage play titled Echoes of the Drums added color to the event. Adetola Kayede, LTV News.